Hey guys, what's going on? I'm here for the end of the video and now I'm super excited for today's video. And that is because I ordered a fingerboard from Broken Knuckle and um, I actually ordered it on Amazon so it's in the biggest package ever. So without further ado, let's tear into this. Yo, I'm super stoked for this. I'm super stoked to put this together for you guys. This feels so nice. Okay, cue the RC shots. Okay, before I get too ahead of myself, um, let's check out what else we got. We got um, two sheets of foam grip tape, which are pretty amazing. Um, all the hardware that we need. Um, a bunch of stickers, which if you have not gotten a broken knuckle or P-Rep, um, those names are interchangeable. Here are what the stickers look like. Um, you also get this um, instruction guide and a coupon for 10% off of my next purchase, which I'm probably going to end up doing that anyway. So, without further ado, I'm going to be setting this board up now. I, I would like to start off by saying that a lot of people um, put the wheels on first and then the grip tape. Um, I'm having trouble if I want to do that or not. One thing I do want to recommend to you guys is be absolutely careful if you do get a, um, an actual fingerboard like this because you have super small hardware. One thing I've got to notice about this board is um, it looks like it has counter screws and the top here which are really nice and the pies are um, white, red, white, red. There may be another white in there as well that I just can't see right now but either way it's super nice. I, I'm, I'm already loving how big this is. Grip tape is so hard to put on. Pro tip. If you're gonna be like me and you're gonna put your bolts over your grip tape, um, the thing that you should probably know how to do is to Take an earring, any earring will do, and poke it through the bottom side of the bolts, like this, and poke it through so that way you can see it, and then poke it on top. Now onto the wheels, which they have actual bearings in them, as um, you can see here. Okay, 
Okay, I think that's a deal. I love this, oh my gosh. <coughs> I don't know why I hesitated to just buy a an actual fingerboard. Ah, I'm so excited, yay. Okay, one thing that they don't tell you is they give you one extra bowl and if I can even hold this, one extra nut. I'm probably getting this wrong, I'm sorry. But either way, they give you one extra of each, so that way in case if you were like me and you just lost down the floor, even though I did find it, they did give it to you. Oh my gosh, this compared to a, um, oh my gosh, this compared to a tech deck, I'm so glad I got this. I mean, I know that this is, you know, really the introduction, the cheapest actual wooden fingerboard that you can buy on Amazon, but I, I'm so glad I got it because compared to this, this is just so much better. I can tell already. Of actually having tricks that are responsive and just literally everything else, which I, I may actually end up just just barely loosening the trucks so that way they are a little bit more responsive. But I mean, I love this. I just love it so much, and I'm so glad I invested in my first actual fingerboard. <laughs> You know what? Cue the montage of the artsy um, shots and the skate session.